what's going on guys welcome back to another video hope all is well this is a tutorial on multi-camera editing you know how when vloggers they you, you can tell they're using multi cameras because they're constantly going back and forth and the audio and everything is perfect well i'm going to show you how to do that in adobe premiere pro it's really simple to do all you have to do is just follow the follow the steps um, follow what I do step by step and rewind if you need to pause if you need to it's I'm gonna show you really simple I'm gonna put it in layman's terms it's not really technical it looks pretty technical as you can see right here but it's not really that bad I'm gonna show you how to do it just follow step by step before I do that make sure you subscribe and also hit the bell notification so you can get updated on my latest content as it drops also feel free to drop a comment below and share if this helped you but drop a comment below um, if you have any questions. Um, also, if you have any suggestions on videos I should make in Adobe Premiere Pro, drop a comment below. And also drop a comment below if you have any type of questions regarding this. All right, so the first thing we're gonna do, we're gonna drag our videos over. You can either drag your media over here or you can just double click right here. This is our editing bin where we have all our media. So I'm just gonna double click and I'm, as you can see, I have two videos here keyed up. So we're just gonna import them over. So I just wanna show you that I have two camera angles. This is the first angle. As you can see, this angle um, is the front camera here. Well, that's the um, bottom camera. This is the um, camera that's facing me. So you can tell I'm looking down at the other camera. So you can tell I have two different camera angles. Now I'm gonna show you something. See how I clapped in the beginning? Well, let's just stop there for a second because I gotta explain to you why I did that. Right now we're in the editing phase. While you're recording, it's important to do those claps because you wanna sync up the audio. That's the reason why I did it. I clapped three times so that uh, when I go into the editing phase of my project, um, the software will have a reference point to um, sync up the audio and that's why I did that and if you notice um, if you ever watch movies and stuff in pre-production they will say lights camera action or they'll say one two three camera action and they'll um, slap the clap um, clapper that's just to sync, uh, sync up the audio so that's why I do it so I just wanted to um, point that out while I'm doing that all right so now that we got our two um, videos set up the next step we're going to do, we're going to create a sequence for our timeline. Now you can, you can, as many ways you can do that. You can just drag your um, videos to your timeline. It'll create a sequence for you. But um, for the sake of this tutorial, I'm going to show you how um, I do it and how I go about editing. So the first thing we're going to do is go to file. We're going to go to new and we're going to go to sequence. Now, just pick this right here DSLR 1080p you can always change this later um, after you've done your um, editing but um, for right now we're gonna leave it at DSLR 1080p all right we're gonna hit OK or just hit enter and like I said when you're following this tutorial just stop it or go back and just follow the steps and trust me when you follow the steps it doesn't matter how many camera angles you have um, just drop all your camera angles in and follow these steps and you too will have a nice simple production here you know why do we do this um, why do we have multi camera angles for one it adds uh, a different feel to your vlogs and also you might want to interview someone you might have a camera on yourself and you might have a camera on your subject so this is um, a good way to um, to do this and uh, like I said this these steps you're gonna be doing this in no time trust me all right so the, the second step we're gonna do these two videos here we got to create a bin all right we got to create a bin for these two so we're gonna go down here see this box where it says new bin click on it and rename it now for this tutorial we're gonna add we're gonna name it multi cams all right so we named it multi cams the third step is we're going to drag these videos into this bin. All right. Hot, um, just right click and drag it down. Left click and drag it down. Okay, so the, the videos are now located in these multi bins. Okay, the fourth step. 
The fourth step. Now remember, pause this if you need to. The fourth step is we're gonna right click and we're gonna click on create multi-camera source sequence. Click on that. Now, since we did the two claps in the beginning to sync up the audio, the only thing we're gonna do is click on audio and we're gonna keep track channel one, all right? So we're gonna, we don't have to do in and out points. We don't have to do that. We're just gonna just click on audio and keep everything else the same. Now also, let me just point out something. When you're doing multi-camera angles, you can also do, you can also have an external, um, you don't have to use the, the camera's uh, audio, even though I did this for this tutorial. You can use an external microphone as well. And you would just drag the external microphone in, in the um, multi-camera bin as well and just and just follow these steps. But maybe I'll do that in a second video, another video, whatever. Okay, so now we have we clicked on audio um, track one and keep everything the same like this and hit OK. All right. So it just created um, the, the sequence here. So now we're gonna just click on the multi-camera bins and open it up. And as you can see, it created a new video. Let me show you. You see how it has um, both of the video side by side. You see that? And all the, um, and the audio is synced up. Let me show you that it's synced up. See, you can tell that it's synced up perfectly. Now, what I'm going to do is I'm going to take out the claps right now. I don't need those claps. So what we're going to do is we're just going to drag it until I start clapping. And then we're just going to edit that out. Let me show you. Okay, that's when I start talking. So right here, you're just going to click on mark in or I on your keyboard. Okay, and then I'm just going to drag it on down and mark it out. All right, so that's all I need. I'm just gonna hit, just hit O on your keyboard or mark it out. Now, what you're gonna do, you're gonna drag this down to your timeline and keep existing settings, that's fine. All right, we're gonna go to the beginning. Okay, now what we're gonna do is we're gonna start chopping up this video so that we can switch the camera angles. All right, so that's what we're gonna do next. Now, you're gonna go over, let me show you. See this button here? You're gonna click on this button. Let me just show you. See this button right here where it says toggle multi-camera view? You're gonna click on that. Okay, you're gonna click on that. Now, if you don't have this option available, you're gonna go to the plus sign and then you're gonna find it and then you're gonna hit okay, all right? So what you're gonna do is you're gonna click on, you're gonna click on this button, toggle multi-camera view. That's what you're gonna do next. And then and the next thing you're gonna do, you're gonna hit play, and then you're gonna, you're gonna click on the angles that you want for this uh, video, right? Like for example, I'm gonna start off um, with this angle right here. And then I'm gonna keep I'm gonna I'm gonna keep clicking on I'm gonna click on these boxes and it's gonna break up the video for me. So at the end it's gonna show um, the sequence. It's gonna show that I'm I'm toggling back and forth. This is how you toggle back and forth between cameras right here. So what we're gonna do is the next step is we're gonna hit play and we're gonna start toggling back and forth to our liking. Watch this. All right, now if I look down, I'm gonna go to this camera, watch this. All right, click on that camera. Click back on this camera. Click here for a little bit, click back here. Click back again. Click back again. Click again, and we're done. Okay, so watch this. So we're gonna go back to the beginning. 
we don't have and then just uncheck this right here uncheck toggle multi camera view just unclick it now watch this it already chopped it up for me see that when i was going back and forth between the cameras it already chopped it up for me so watch how it, now watch how it plays out see how it see how it um chopped it up for me See how it's syncing up perfectly? And it's real simple to do, guys. Real simple. All right, guys, and that is the tutorial. It's real simple to do. And like I said, um, when you go back, right? When you go back, all you have to do, when you go back, all you have to do is follow these steps. Just follow it step by step. If you have to pause, if you need to, um, you'll get it, trust me. And another thing you can do is if you wanna improve the audio, I'm gonna have a different uh, video in how we can improve the audio. But if you wanna uh, make this a little louder, you just go up to audio here, just play it, and you can just increase the audio. Yeah, you just edit the um, audio a little bit. But I'm gonna, in another video, I'm gonna show you a tutorial step by step and how you can. Uh, improve the audio through Adobe Premiere Pro. All right, guys. Well, that's my tutorial, and I hoped it helped. Now, like I said, I only did two camera angles here, but you can do multi camera angles. It doesn't matter. If you have five cameras, you can um, edit with five cameras. All you have to do is follow the steps, like I said. All right, guys. Thank you for watching. I hope this helped. Again, do me a favor subscribe and also hit the bell notification so you can get updated on my latest videos like this when it drops if you have any questions drop a comment below and um or drop a comment below if it helped you and also share the video if you like all that'll be greatly appreciated guys until next video peace